guys. We're mowing motherfucking lawns. God damn Can you move it. the Steven Universe box over? Please move. And the and just shove it off to the sides. There we go. Perfect. Yes. Nothing was in this shot ever. It was always perfect. Oh. It was always perfect. Okay. Oh, and there's three save slots. That's exciting. Yeah, so we can each have a save slot if we need it. Okay, would you like to turn off tutorials? No, okay, we, might wanna, need, we might need to play with tutorials. I've never mowed a lawn before. Okay, let's get started. Oh, cool. Oh my god. It's got to be a fun Company wall. Company name. It's got to be fun wall. Why on... Whoa. Yes, Land and then we could do our solo one, which is just you know whatever we decide. But I figure since we're doing this sort of simultaneously, oh, logo. I want to pick a bitch and logo. Okay. I like, think that that saw looking one is probably the coolest. It really is. Oh, you can edit your player. Oh, we gotta edit the player, man. Press the. Oh, I wanted to. Okay. Okay. Player. Player appearance. Avatar. Oh, you can be a chick. Oh, this is a very. The sprites between chicks and dudes is not that much different. I mean, it's realistic. N nah, it's not realistic. Looks like a woman to me. Trans mask woman. Okay. A tra uh, first off, tra you can't use trans mask and woman in the same sentence. Because well, trans mask automatically disqualifies women. Oh, you got a point there. Because it's uh, it's trans masculine. She's giving me stud lesbian vibes. Yeah, I mean I can get that, but it's like, why are they all like damn near flat chested? That's a good question. It's very slow turning them around. Because the whole thing is, is like, if you look at the man and you look at her, there's not much difference in the chest area. Really not. Uh, okay, whatever. Uh, just. Ah, uh, just this guy, I guess. Change his hat. I want a green hat. <laughs> but like a dark green. Yeah. Logo placement. <clears throat> What's that last one? No. Oh, no logo. Should do front and back. Uniform color. I like black. And we're gonna go green to go with the shirt. Confirm. Confirm. Yes! Confirm. Confirm. Are you happy? Yes! Test drive. Now that you have a company of your own, you need your first vehicle. Select a vehicle. The vehicle is equipped with a collector. This vehicle is collect. This vehicle is equipped with a collector type deck. That means as you cut it, the grass clippings are sucked up into the vehicle's hopper. Okay, this one has a discharge deck, so like it'll fucking shit out the side. Mm -hmm. This one. Uh. Mulch. Yeah, mulch. It cuts it really, really fucking small. <laughs> Which one do we want? Okay. We did the collection one. The hopper one? Uh, it goes five miles an hour. It has a six liter fuel capacity. Yeah, but that one's going to be the better one because the rest of them are going to have to clean up all the grass shavings. We got a point there. Alright, cool. I like that one. Or you can test drive. You can test drive. We can try and see here. Test drive. Yes. Oh, man. Dino Safari DLC. We'll have to see how good this game is. And if the game is good, we might get the DLC. I, I mean... I would very much love mowing dino enclosures. Absolutely. Look how relaxed this guy is. And he's just like, oh, there's dinosaurs, yeah, dinosaurs back there. Around. It understand. is what it is. I understand. In what weather, it's much easier to damage the ground. Be careful when cutting in the rain. Oh, there are. Okay. There's fucking weather effects in this game? I guess. Welcome to the test drive area. Okay, 
approach the vehicle and get on it. Oh shit. The movement is very nice. Get on the vehicle. Okay. This is why it took so long to download. Yeah, it's really intense for a lawn mowing game. Okay, we need to start it. Alright. Next, we want to download it on my computer, but I know it's not going to fucking work on my computer. You can change the throttle. Like a regular lawnmower? Go oh, drive, go get some grass. Change the cut height. Okay, X to engage and disengage cutting. Drive yes. to the grass. I imagine it probably has a collection method for the rest of them. Like you have to go and collect it. What cutout do we want? Six, seven, eight, nine. What? How many centimeters? Let's do six. Oh my God. Okay. The contracts have certain requirements. Okay. Is this one down any? Well, this is a test drive thing, right? I'm cutting grass! Okay, okay. Wow. We're cutting grass. We are cutting grass, bro. You know what? Yeah. I feel like this is almost as relaxing as Power Watch Simulator. It really is the same vibe. But we'll have to see. If this one has stupid, unrealistic requirements to beat a level. Yeah, I could imagine this one might have the same problem. Well, I don't know. What I like about this is it has, like, actual, like, requirements and shit. You know, the rest of them, it's, like, in Power Wash Simulator, it's just you get in, you clean, and you get paid for everything that you clean. But this one, it seems like you actually have like legitimate tasks that you have to accomplish. And all of that. Yeah. And you're mowing the grass. I am mowing grass. I wonder if this is going to have a time lapse thing like Power Wash Simulator does when oh, sure. I'm Turn the fucking thing off. Oh man, this. I don't understand how throttle works. What do you mean? I don't understand how throttle works. Like, in what way? I don't understand how it works and what it does. It makes you go faster. Okay, by holding the... Alright. Hold the B button for what? Oh, uh, to get off the vehicle. I'm trying to do the thing you just said. Oh, okay. It's exactly like Power Wash Simulator. You know what? I mean, I guess you didn't really need that in that situation, because obviously, you could see all of this grass is not completed. Oh yeah, get around the tree! Get around that tree! I'm not even mowing. I was just moving around in the grass. <laughs> Dang it. You know what, Michaela? Sometimes you just gotta touch the waters. I can't let you up here right now, the little fancy ladies. Hey, well, tell me what the fucking height is that it's supposed to... Cut height, five to six. Don't you have it on six? Yeah. Uh, be careful how fast I'm going. You can't just go as fast as you want, apparently. 
This game is definitely a lot more realistic. Yeah, you can't zoom around, apparently. And no, I'm not cutting any particular pattern just because I'm that kind of bitch. I already noticed that and I've made peace with it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I probably need to start doing patterns because this is going to take forever if I don't. No, just keep going like you're going. It'll be fine. Plus, this isn't like the actual game yet. We're just test driving it. We're mowing grass. Yeah, I'm mowing grass. You know, it started off as a joke saying I was excited to play this fucking game. But now I kind of am. I'm, I'm digging this for real. But this actually looks really relaxing. It's incredible. I can imagine the DLC for this game being bomb as hell. Like, you could mow grass on other planets. You could, they could add lore. Oh my god. Uh, they probably do have lore. We're not playing the actual game yet. But I'm, I gotta mow everything before it'll let me. Don't you just gotta mow to that little yellow line? Oh, that's incredible. Thank god. I could be wrong, but I assume that's why the little yellow line is there, right? Hopefully. Look at you, cutting that grass. I imagine I should probably get used to mowing in a pattern. Because I feel like that's going to come into play. In the actual storyline part of this game? Yeah. Definitely. I'm probably going to have to use all of the mowers during the storyline too. Because they're going to be more versatile at different things. I mean, they just need to get it over with and just do Dad Simulator, the game. I would tear... Oh, that was the... Uh, technical difficulties, everyone. That was the technical difficulties music. Okay. Which is customary for I every... I seem to have changed the view, and this is a much more annoying view. Very picturesque, though. There we go. How'd you change it back? I pressed this button. Okay. Okay. Wow, it has been approximately 13 minutes, and we have... Oh, well, you completed about 12.3%, which is about 1% per minute. 1%. Not bad. Not yeah, bad at all. Just get that patch in the middle that was right in front of you. you where? You just, right there. You see where all your lines are? There's a huge chunk in the middle there. You see that? Right here? Yeah, that one. Nope. And the one next to that. The bigger one that was next to that. That's like in a weird... That one. Yes, that one. Get rid of that one. Oh, I could totally see me doing just patterns in the grass. grass here, bro. I really fucked myself around doing this whole, just drive where you want! I mean, that's how I mow grass IRL when I'm on a riding mower. I'll just, like, go around in fucking circles and hope for the buzz. I wasn't allowed to ride on riding mowers after the incident. A after the incident? I get a little crazy on riding mowers. And you're just not gonna explain any further. Okay, I was the oldest among the kids that were there that day. And this sounds wanted... like some war story you're about to tell. No, I haven't been. That bad. I haven't been allowed to drive on riding mowers since the incident. Well, they. You realize how dramatic you sound? They. I didn't mean to sound dramatic. 
they hooked up a little tiny trailer to the back of this riding lawnmower and they wanted me to drive the little kids around like a miniature hayride on I this can lawnmower. see where this is going. And I forgot where I was at for a minute and I started going like as fast as it would go, like fucking jumping hurdles. Like I'm s i am was in the air for a while. And then I realized there was babies back there and they were screaming. But it all worked out because later on they were like, hey, that was fun. But the parents were like, that's dangerous. Now when I went with my grandma, we did a similar thing. Me and uh, Chatty, which is the girl that lived next door, that lives next door to my grandma. Uh, I would drive the riding lawnmower around to mow the grass. And then when we were done with that, we would just drive the riding lawnmower around with one of us in the back and the trailer that we were using to pick up the grass with. Yeah. So, you know, when you cut the grass, you have to pick up the shaving. I never did. We never did. Well, my grandma did because she's a little OCD. Oh, well, that makes sense, yeah. And especially after her stroke, she got, like, really OCD, so it's just, you know. You're getting better at this. The cutting is easier if, for me, if I disengage the cutting while I'm backing up and getting straight again. Because then mm. I don't have, like, these weird... I haven't had hot Cheetos in such a long time. Really? For context, to the people who can't see the bag of hot Cheetos in my hands, it does exist. See, look. Yeah, Cheeto, bruh. I should have got toffees. Side note, <clears throat> the Ruffles hot, Flaming Hot Barbecue is not hot. I got them because... I had the Frito version of Flamin' Hot Barbecue, and I loved those. It wasn't extremely hot either. I just liked it. But they didn't have the ones I wanted. Yeah, but so Fritos is a little like I don't know. You know? Right. When I hear hot chip, when I hear Flaming Hot, I think spicy. And ass bleeding. And, and yeah, I told you that earlier. I want to wake up shit and blood. I'm not there for that. No, I wow, say this, this is a very impressive patch of grass. Look at that. Look at that impressive patch of grass right there, guys. That is an impressive honestly. patch of grass. It honestly is. And I can't think of a more impressive patch of grass than that patch of grass right there. Wow. A nice patch of grass. That's a nice about what does that say? 16% of the grass. 15, yeah. I gave you an extra percentage. Because you're just that good with that patch of grass and money book that you deserve an extra percent. Oh my god, this is, this takes hours. It honestly does. It's like mowing real grass. No where do they stream this game? People stream this game? Yep. I don't know, I'm finding it hard to be entertaining. Honestly, I would watch this. I would watch someone stream this. I'm that type of person. Well, I mean, I figured it was a streamable game. That's why I'm filming it. That's what my first instinct was. I'm totally filming this. With no prior knowledge than the fact that it was a lawnmower simulator, I was like, yep, prime video material right there. And you know what? I think that was a great choice on my part. And now I'm curious to look up, but at the same time, I don't want to look up a playthrough because I want to play it raw the first time for myself in case there is more bits or something. Yeah, definitely. Man, I... Because I feel like, just like in Power Wash Simulators, there's got to be something in this game like that. But there's a campaign mode. If it was just about mowing grass, it would just be a bunch of lawns that needed to be mowed. Yeah. Like, I feel like there's going to be some sort of a storyline. And if not, I'm going to make up one in my head. I can see this lawn mowing thing. This is only the tester, and it's a big lawn. So I feel like I can see this campaign, like the, the 
actual meat of the game being taking forever. Probably not once you know what you're doing, and I imagine you get better equipment the more you play the campaign mode. Yeah, that's true. I didn't think about that. So I imagine it'll probably, you might end up with like a giant ass tractor, which you cut the time in half. And it would be really cool, I can live out all my tractor driving dreams. Tractor driving dreams. Which we all have tractor driving dreams. And if you don't, I say you're a liar. Look at the lines, the pristine lines in the grass. Now keep going, going up to the tree. No, I missed a slice. I missed a slice right here. She has the right idea to go around the tree, but she did it at like the worst possible angle you could have gone around the tree. Like you should have hugged it tighter, you know what I mean? Yeah. Also knowing this because I've mowed around a lot of trees in my grandma's yard. Just gotta get right in there. What is it, Wendy Pooh? Come here, you little old fancy butt. Oh, I got you. I got you. It's okay. There you go, Wendy. That's one little old fancy lady taken care of. Isn't that right, Wendy Pooh? Wow. Well. So, uh, how's the weather? You know, it's hot. That is so true. That is so true. Am I the asshole for scolding my knees for having heard this? having her disdain dis dis dyslexia destination wedding on a Sunday night what the fuck is a destination wedding it's a wedding uh, that's also a vacation for everyone you go like to Hawaii or to the Caribbean or something that is such a terrible name for that And I don't know why my immediate thought was disdain wedding, which makes literally no sense. Wedding for how much we hate each other. Do you take this uh, person to have and to hold in hatred and vitriol for the rest of your days? I do. You may now stab each other in the back. I fucked your mom. Well, I fucked your dad. We're so happy. <laughs> I hate you so much. Okay, let's see here. Okay. Now that we've had that little tangent about what a disdain wedding would be. You know, a little stabby stabby in the back at the wedding night, you know. Normal couple shit, right? Ah, oh, shit. Oh, I read it wrong. Am I the asshole for scolding my niece for having her destination wedding on a Sunday night? I thought it said for leaving. I don't know how I got leaving. But that's what I read. Not sure what my brain's on right now. Well, uh, but... Okay, let's not do any more. We might get copyright. Okay. 
Okay. They see me mowing. They hating. Patrolling. Trying to catch me. Leaving it dirty. Trying to catch me. Leaving it dirty. Leaving it dirty. They see me mowing. They hating. Patrolling. Trying to catch me. Riding dirty. Well, I was mowing grass back when I was young. <laughs> well, my brother said it's pretty fucked up. I don't know. I don't know. What's another theme song we can moify? Moify. <laughs> Is that what we're doing now? So we're calling. Uh, it's a new genre to moify the music. Forest, but the lawn is we high. <laughs> Did they send push mowers? Why not send me five? I'll duct tape them all together so I can mow this grass until. Oh, nice. Yeah, I was right. You just had to okay. get to the thingy. Now I can leave location. All right. Did a good job here, you guys. See, all it took was saying. Somehow I'll mow this grass. We didn't do the obvious. Like I do. What? We didn't do the obvious one. Fucking, what's that song? Wanna take a ride on my big green tractor? We, we can, can go, go slow, slow. make it go faster. As long as I'm with you, it really don't matter. Yeah. We can take a ride on my big green tractor. A country song about sex. I didn't know that's what it was about. That's an autistic moment. I really thought it was about <laughs> riding on her tractor. Nah. Oh, he, she's riding a tractor, all right. She's riding something. Okay, leave location. I want to try that, to... That was a live-caught autistic moment. I swear to God, I have always thought that I was about actually driving around on a legitimate big green tractor. Because I thought that was cool as fuck. I'd want to drive around on a big green tractor. Get out of the vehicle. The fuel will cover. Change cutting blades. Okay, we gotta leave. You can upgrade your truck too. No, it's just a leave. No, I see, like, go back. If you look at the muffler, it's like there's a little thingy down there too in the muffler section. Or I'm crazy. I'm just crazy. You probably can upgrade your stuff because you guys get richer. I mean, that would be the. Imagine driving up to mow this person's lawn in like an Escalade. <laughs> Fucking a whole ass limo and pulling Purchase a little lawnmower. Or would you like to test drive another vehicle? Do we like this well, one? Well, let me test drive another vehicle. You want to test drive the blue one or the black one? I'm gonna go with the The black blue. one has the mulcher and it doesn't go very fast. Uh, it has five liter fuel tank. Uh, has a bigger go. deck, no, has a bigger deck size. I'm gonna go with big blue. Big blue, okay. It just blows the shit out the side, but it goes seven miles an hour as a medium. It has the smallest deck. Yeah. I'm gonna test drive. We gotta decide. It's not the size that matters, it's the motion in the ocean. Yeah. Or in this case, the way it cuts the grass. Nice. Wow. Okay. Look at that sexy piece of machinery right there. Okay. Okay, Just how do I do the X to start the engine? Now you're gonna have to read those tiny, yes. tiny texts. Okay, now use the left and right push buttons to change the vehicle's throttle. Oh, left and right. There we go. Now you just press X once to engage. That's how you engage and disengage the cutting. Board. And now use the triggers to go forward and backwards. Okay, hold on. You turned it off. I know I'm supposed to put it at six, right? Yeah, just go up and down for that. You gotta hold X. Turn it back on. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Turn back on! Hold on. Hold I'm holding There X. we go. Now do the throttle again. All you gotta do is press it one time. And now, yes, you're off. Wow. So I press X down to cut? Yeah, don't hold it, just press it. There we go. I'm going so fast. I'm a fast boy. Yeah, and apparently when it's red, you're going too fast to fuck it shit up. I know. 
No need hey to now, it. I'm a rock star. Get your go on. on. Get mode. Hey now, I'm a rock star. Get your game on. Get mode. All that glitters is grown. Only shooting stars break the mode. Yeah. Well, the grass starts mowing and it don't stop mowing. I get on the ground and I just start mowing. Didn't make sense not to mow for fun. I mowed this lawn and I had so much fun. Yeah! So much to do, so much to see, so, so much wrong with taking the back street. You'll never know no, if, if you, you don't, don't mow. Grow. You'll never shine if you don't mow. Yeah! Hey now, you're a mo star. Get your game on. Go yeah. play. Oh. Hey now, you're a mo star. I don't know any more words to say. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on. Oh, it's not even giving me a progress bar. I'm really upset by that. Oh. That's bullshit. I wonder why. How, how am I supposed to know if, if I want to. I'm upset by that, but this one definitely goes way faster. Yeah, it really does. Press the start button and see. Oh, it's unlimited. Okay, yeah. Oh, okay, but I'm quitting that. Let's play the real game now. All right. Okay, so now I gotta pick which one I want to buy. I I vote we go with the yellow. Yeah. I was thinking of yellow too. Cause this one, like, I don't know if I'll have to pick the grass up, and I don't want to if that's the case. Well, I just tested oh, it out. Oh, there's cost, there's cost. How, okay, much? how much money do I have? Doesn't say. I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah, see, look, you can see some of the other ones you can unlock. I have $851. Well, which one's the cheapest? The yellow one. Well, then we're getting the yellow one. Okay, while the mower is great for open areas of grass. Oh, I got a notification. Look we're gonna weed eat too? Yes, we are gonna weed eat. Oh my god. Red, excuse me, if you're in another country, this is a string trimmer. String trimmer. In America, it's weed eating, but I guess. String trimmer. All right. That. Do we want, okay, this one is gas powered, cutting width 36 centimeters. This one's 41 centimeters and is battery type. Gas powered's gonna be more powerful overall. Yeah, and it's cheaper. So we're gonna get that one. Confirm. Okay, this is the contract map where you see available contracts to select and start. Now that your company's set up, select the contract button at the bottom of the map to open it for setup. Okay, so. We've only got one. The front garden at Old Nook Cottage. Once you select a contract, you can see information about its value and requirements. If you wish to accept the contract, you need to sign an employee vehicle and equipment. Okay. So I assign myself, get my yellow mower, and my little trimmer. Okay, the front garden at the cottage requires a general cut. The lawn is surrounded by flower beds, so take care not to damage them. Oh. And don't leave grass clippings in the bed. Okay. Alright. Cutting height 5 to 6 centimeters. Okay. We're gonna do 5 centimeters. 5 to 6 centimeters. I was mowing my lawn last night. Cause you mow your lawn in the middle of the night. Yeah, you do. And I saw this random guy. How long have guy. we been recording this lawnmower game? 34 minutes. Okay! 34 minutes of lawn mowing. And most of which was us making lawn mowing related songs. Okay. That being said, unfortunately for you guys, you will not see the completion of the first lawn. Okay. 
At the start of each contract, you have a small period of time to find and remove any objects on the grass area. Okay, so I gotta go out into my garden and get shit out of the grass now. Oh, take that object. All right. ambient music. Now we're fucking emo. exists and the game can't go on otherwise. So it's gotta be near the flower beds. It's gotta be okay, let's near the gates. There, there it is. is. I told you it's by the flower it's beds. It's a turd. I think it was a turd. Well I had to pick up shit so I can mow this fucking lawn. And I really hate my job. I wonder if they really have to do that. Do they have to pick up the poop? Yeah, they have to pick up all this shit, literally and not literally, out of the yard before they can mow or weed it, because otherwise you're gonna end up cutting the shit and you'll have a bunch of shit all over your body. Okay. There is different attachments! Yep, there is. Okay, I wanna get use this to get up plus personal with the flower beds. Pussy out of my way! Just throw him down. Get out of the way! I got it. Uh -huh. You guys just have to lose the ambient music for right now. I know everyone's very upset by that fact. This flower bed thing. Please get down, Mr. And Mrs. Cat. Well, you're just a mister. I don't know why I called you Mr. And Mrs. Here you go, Slinky Kitty. I love you, it's my home, I love you. Fine, run away from me then, bitch. No, you ran away from me. You don't get to shove your head into my legs like you want to love me. You ran away. No, you're not getting up there. You're not getting up here either. I don't understand what you're doing, cat. You didn't want my love. Uh, I think I'm gonna get put this back and get on the actual mower. So you can actually make a lot of progress? Yes, I made 0.5 percent. Like, I know I'm gonna have to use that to... Uh... Cat, I don't know what you're doing, but I wish you would decide what it is. Watch, I'm gonna get up 
and you're going to run to the kitchen like you don't have food in there when I know you have food in there. And you only ever want to love me when you want food. What you have in there? You only ever want to love me when you've got food. I'm just gonna let this camera keep running until it dies, so if we ever get cut off in mid sentence, that's what happened. Monkey, what do you want? God, cat. You don't even want my love. You just want to be irritating. I wonder if you can destroy the flower beds by running over them. That is how you would destroy the flower beds. Don't stick your ass in my face, cat! Sit down! God damn it, cat! What just fell? Oh Get God. down from there, Jesus! Oh, I'm in the trees. I got it. This one doesn't have all pieces anyway. It did at some point. They're all over the fucking floor now. Because the cat doesn't know how to stay off of shit that I told him to stay off of. Just glad he didn't get on my fucking altar this time. And you immediately try to go up there. Okay, cat. Go on somewhere. Oh my god, this cat. Well, this one isn't nearly as big as the other one was. Yeah, it's really not. So at least there's that. You're gonna have to weed eat that section right there by those bushes, though. Yeah, I know. I'm just trying to get... Everything else first. Well, this is riveting content. Mm -hmm. Truly riveting content. I mean, nobody can accuse the Kyatonic channel of unriveting content. Never mind that most of my uploads consist of TikTok level YouTube videos. Right down to being about a minute long most of the time. Which I have affectionately called my depression vlogs. Depression vlogs. Which I'm trying to get out of the habit of posting, but my computer is kind of a bitch. And I don't like to deal with it. You know what I mean? Absolutely. I just took down that bitch's flowers just now. Oh. Sometimes you gotta take down a couple of flowers from all the good lawns. Hope not. She specifically asked me to change not to hit her fucking flowers. Well, that's her fault for putting her flowers so close to the grass that needed to be cut. You seem to be doing a very good job of missing the flowers. This is messing with What, the sexy, sexy grass patches you got going on? Absolutely. Camera angles are a bit weird, though. Yeah, that's... It's kind of hard to get a good angle. I mean, is there any more views than just the two that we know of? Yeah, it's got a... I can move the camera all around me. No, I mean, I know that you could change the focal point of the camera by hitting the button, so it goes... There's that one, and then I imagine there should be other ones. I 
And another thing I like to complain about, it's kind of hard after a while to see what needs to be mowed, weirdly, because it's green and green. So sometimes it's a little hard for me I to... I think you might be vaguely colorblind. It's green and green. Or well, I'm too much of an artist. There's a sheer difference in the tone of the green. The green of the non-cut grass is a lot darker than the green of the cut grass. Yeah, when you're when I'm looking at it and not moving it is, but then when I really get to going, sometimes they just kind of run together. Maybe it's a sign that these people didn't really need their grass cut in the first place. They have the like flashback, like speed run like you did. Damn it! I destroyed the flower. Damn, Michaela, you tried so hard. You tried so hard and got so far. In the end, I mowed over a flower. I've come too far. To lose it all. In the end, I just mowed over a flower. Yeah, we did. I love how this is just us complaining about things in the game, talking about the sexy, sexy pieces of grass, and then being like, making mowing versions of popular songs. I mean, you just know that other people are doing that too. I don't know why it's impossible not to do that. No, I think that might just be an us thing. You think so? Yeah. The lot I was mowing a lawn. And I got paid to mow the lawn. <laughs> <laughs> I need to move the lawn. And I slept on the lawn. I really like these lawns. Bartender, I really did this time. Grow them up, roll them on a good line. When I got home, it was 6 p.m. The door was locked, so I kicked it in. She said, why are you mowing lawns? I said, I need to find a job. She said, it doesn't fucking matter. You don't care anymore. Then she kicked me out, and she called me a whore. <laughs> you whore! So I'm sitting at the bar on the inside, waiting for my ride on the outside. I can't be 25 square miles from a lawn. Makes my life really hard. Yeah, he got a restraining order against lawns. <laughs> now there's a backstory. Yeah. Man, I feel so beautiful right now. For <laughs> some reason. I feel so majestic mowing this fucking lawn. All tough and masculine. That's right, so they need to make a dad simulator that's just like power wash simulator with this, with like they other do. dad relating chart like jobs that are traditional dad chores, like barbecue simulators. Oh my god, dad simulator? Literally, I would that's tear the that whole thing. Oh. I, I might make that. That might be my first game. I might oh, make a dad man. simulator. I would thoroughly tear that ass up on some dad simulator. Please, whoever you are out there. Gamer gods, Gamer hero, gods. please! I bet, I wonder if that's a thing. I'm looking up to see if there's a dad simulator. Because if there is, I sure will be getting that as soon as I have any money to purchase it. Dad simulator. I'm sorry, what? What? Shower with your dad simulator. That is not the same thing.
It's got a 10 out of 10 on Steam. 77% of people like this video game. Would you like to hear the description? Uh, sure. Shower with your dad simulator 2015. Do you still shower with your dad? No. It's a fast-paced shower simulator where you shower with your 8-bit dad. It's good, clean, fun. Actually, I think I played that game. Oh. Well, was it good, clean, fun? I don't remember. I assume not. It must not have been that fun, then. Wait, hold on. My God, McKay. What? There's a dad simulator. There is. It was made for a game jam back in 2016. A hot dog. It doesn't look like it's like what we were saying though. Looks like you got to fix like a stove and a leak. Do daily ritual tasks for you and your son before the night is done. First person. Don't you dare get up there right this second, cat. No! God damn it! You were doing so good! Stay down from there! I'm sorry, I'm not abusing my cat. I'm just placing him off of my goddamn altar. I can uh, verify he's not like chunking the cat around the room. He's just gently picking him up and setting him off. <laughs> it just sounds aggressive. Because the cat keeps on knocking over all the breakable shit on my altar, and now I've lost pieces to it that I can't even fucking find. I have no idea where they went. They just disappeared. That's like there's weird. a jar of salt missing, I think. That's weird. And there's two mushrooms missing. It's like completely missing? Yeah, they're gone. They're nowhere up there. I'm amazed this fucking cat hasn't managed to knock the goddamn wax over! God, get up there again! Do it! Go on! Mowing lawns. We are mowing lawns. Now let's get back to this Am I the Asphalt post, which I never finished reading because we started singing about mowing lawns. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright. My niece, my sister's daughter, is getting married this weekend, and her weekend is on Sunday. I'll skip on it because it's a destination wedding, not too far away, but still away from our main city. And it's on a Sunday. On Monday, I'm working, as do most of us. My son and his girlfriend will go despite my pleas not to. Why are you telling your son and his girlfriend not to go? Yeah, like, what's the deal? If it's not that far from where you live, couldn't y'all take Monday off? This was clearly planned way ahead of time. It's a wedding. Like, weddings don't just spring up the day that you're supposed to have the wedding and they're like, okay, we're having the wedding in a week. Hopefully you can show up. Uh, do you want to mow lawns? Is that what it is? No. Oh, he huh. just wants to annoy the fucking life out of you. Okay. You're ugly. I'll be I'll hurt your feelings. <laughs> <laughs> he goes all noodly when you pick him up. <laughs> yes he does, because he's a little noodle bee. He's a little noodle bean. Yes, you're a little noodle bean. Thank you for not being a dickhead cat. I know, I love you too, Smokey. 
Yeah, I love you too, Jack. Even though you really annoy the life out of me sometimes. Yeah, I still love you. Even though you're irritating as shit sometimes. Can I go back to reading my shit, please, Cat? Or are we just doomed to not have an Am I the Asshole be read? Ever. Oh my god, bro. I think I'm like, addicted. Like, you've had all day to get up here and annoy me, and you wait until I'm filming a video to actually come get love and affection. Yeah, and this is so riveting and distracting, I mean... It is very riveting. I mean, we're, we haven't even really been saying all too much during long sections of this, just because the gameplay is very, like, entrancing. It really is. I, I downloaded this as a joke at first. Like, Literally, it was a whole ass joke. I did not expect this game to actually be... I'm not even playing it, and I'm finding it equally as satisfying. I uh, know. I'm literally like. Don't you fucking dare knock the goddamn camera over, cat. Stay, uh, stay away from that section. Stay. I said, stay away from that section, please. Jesus. Damn, cat. I'll probably one day get canceled because people are gonna assume I abuse my animals. Nah. Over this dickhead. But then again, any cat owner will fucking know that cats might be the most amazing little furballs ever sometimes, but sometimes they're fucking demons with fur and adorable little faces. God damn it, if I didn't love you so much. I would have thrown you on the street. <laughs> Not really. I did save this cat from a burning house. She really did. That's where he got his beautiful name of Smokey. He's the only one out of his litter that lived through that goddamn house fire. And he acts just like his daddy, too. Who was also a shithead. And a pain in my ass. And if he was alive right now, I'd have two fucking shitheads annoying the life out of me. But I don't know, Sapphire might have killed Smokey. Sapphire was a fucking badass. Killed squirrels. He had a whole scar on his face from killing squirrels. He got into a fight with a squirrel, and you know what, McKayla? He fucking won. Damn right he goddamn did. Praise the devil. Praise Satan. You're goddamn right. Hail Satan. Sometimes you gotta even it out. You know, you know what? Fuck it. Uh, blessed be Allah. Just get Muslims in there. Um, Vishnu is a Hindu god. Bar. Right? V Vishnu is a Hindu god. I didn't say that right. I watched a uh, lady on TikTok talk about what all those words mean, and I am not the best at saying. Obviously, I don't speak Arabic, or I don't know a lot about the Muslim faith, but I think it's Alu Akbar, right? So, uh, I think it's Allah Akbar. Allah uh, as in God. Oh. Because that's what they call their God is Allah. Allah Akbar. Allah Akbar. See, what's weird is since, you know, the other day when we had that whole conversation about face coverings yeah. from Muslim traditions and whether or not it made somebody the asshole, well, it turns out that there are, in fact, parts of Muslim women that they can't even show anyone except for their husband at all. Yeah, it's... It's literally anything from their neck down they cannot show at all, and some of them can't even show their face to, you know. to men and women. And like, men also... Contrary to popular belief, have some restrictions on the way they dress, too. They have to cover from their neck to their knees as well. But women often have to cover their face and their hair on top of it. And them. you know what? Like, they still look incredibly beautiful. Oh, yes. 
Like it does not take away from their beauty. In some ways it enhances it, I feel it like. It really does because they look so beautiful and soft. Like it, it all adds, the time. for me, I like like the mystery of it. And I kind of get like in a way. I, like, now there are sexist undertones, I'm not going to deny that. But that's in literally every, every religion. Abrahamic, Abrahamic religion. Because I'm not going to say every religion, because there's plenty of religions that are very women forward, like Wicca. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Abrahamic religions all tend to be very misogynistic. However, I will say that, you know, I get why they do it. Exactly, yeah. And you know, that is just how things go. And you know, I've met actually some, uh, not met in real life, but I've seen in my research of some pagans who veil and do head coverings. That is, that is a thing, I believe. I don't know why, but it is a thing. Anyway, let's get back to reading this Am I the Asshole post that I keep on neglecting to continue, okay. continue reading and I get speak. Okay. My son and his girlfriend will go despite my pleas not to. I told them it's a waste of money and it's very wrong how my niece has her wedding on a Sunday night, expecting most of us to skip work the following day. Once again, it is a wedding. You just want food, don't you? Go in the bathroom. I see that's where you're going. Just go in the bathroom. Go through your little curtain, climb on your little chair in there and go into the bathroom. Yes, we have a chair in our bathroom. Don't ask why. I will not explain any further. Enjoy the lawn mowing. Damn it. Anyway, what I was saying is, is like literally it's a wedding that has been planned for most likely half a year before this. Because weddings take a lot to plan and a lot of money and shit. Right? Yeah. Because they're a whole ass wedding. But, uh, where are we going with this? Like, you're kind of an asshole for just assuming that they're doing this as an inconvenience to everybody else. Maybe they're doing it because, I don't know, they love each other and they want to get married? No, they're getting married on Sunday, specifically. That's the problem, is they're getting married on Sunday. Is it like a Christianity thing? Like, or is she a Christian? No, she just complained that she has to go to work the next day. Which you could have taken off. Yeah, you really could have. It's not like you didn't know about this in advance. Like, she's acting like they just eloped that night and said, Okay, this weekend, we're going to fucking Honolulu, Hawaii to get married, and I want you all to come on a Sunday. My son said he doesn't care. Neither does his girlfriend, and they'll just take the day off, as any normal person would. But this doesn't sit right with me. I had RSVP'd no, that I won't attend, and I left a note at the email saying, it's very inconvenient that they chose that day. Now I feel they should be more thoughtful of those who work the next day. Why? And can't attend their destination wedding. Okay, now that is the problem. Okay, they're having a destination wedding, which means their fucking wedding is very expensive to attend and it's probably full of rich people. Okay, you have three minutes to explain your point. She's just upset that she doesn't have the money to attend a destination wedding. That's what she's upset about. No, Not that it, she has to it work really, for no, it really sounds like she's upset because they planned it specifically on a Sunday. Because she has to go to work. Because It's a destination wedding. If they're having a destination wedding, that means they come from a family of wealth. Her exactly. family must then in turn be wealthy. Oh, you got it. That's true. So I don't think that's what the issue is. It Unfortunately, no for you guys, you're going to have to hold off on all of that and seeing the completion of this lawn. Which you will see never. You got to 90.8% on this one lawn, and that's all I could do to get the camera's battery. Not battery, but storage is running out. So, bye guys.